Thank you, sir. First, I'll explain Senate Bill 209. It's simply any retired state trooper that comes back on the uh, state, troop, uh, state police force will be able to accrue vacation days, sick leave, and holiday pay. This is a good incentive to allow retired troopers to come back during our times of shortage. So I will, that is Senate, uh, Senate Bill 209. And now I'm going to call the House. And now I will call the House Committee Substitute 1. Please. Clerk, please report. House Committee Substitute 1 to Senate Bill 209. General from Jefferson. Move passage. Motions for the adoption of House Committee Substitute 1. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, those in favor signify by voting aye. Those opposed, nay. House Committee Substitute 1 is adopted. General from Jefferson. The, the committee sub is a, a retention plan <clears throat> that will increase the health subsidy of all Tier 1B retirees that want to work past their normal retirement uh, age. If a person continues to work past his or her normal retirement age, then every year extra that retiree works, he or she will receive $5 extra added to their health subsidy. This plan has a mechanism to stop the subsidy if the retiree health insurance funding drops below 90 percent, and they're all just about at 90 percent. And if you remember what Tier 1B health insurance is, it's all those employees, CERS, KERS, state troopers, that uh, all the ones that started after 2003. And so some of them, especially the hazardous troopers and firefighters, will be retiring after 20 years uh, in 2023. And uh, I'm getting the question, but they, it, I need to go a, a little bit more here. The retirees also will be able to go to the open market on the health insurance plans instead of just only doing the uh, state plans. So the beauty of this system is that it's a retention incentive. So our uh, troopers, and this applies to, to all employees hired after 2003, the more they work, the better their health insurance subsidy, subsidy will become, and also the beauty of it is their health, their pension liability will reduce because they're working longer years. So KLC got behind this and that was a hard catch. I want to thank Brad Gross, FOP, and the firefighters, especially Representative Miller for... Jefferson, uh, 36. Move passage, sir, of Senate Bill 209 as amended by House Committee Substitute 1.